next level. This is next level animation. Absolutely blown away by the camera movement, transitions, editing, sound design. Um, the story was so emotional. I probably haven't cried that hard since Titanic. Um, I would give you a 10 on 10 on all technical aspects. I'm surprised that um, Pixar has not emailed you yet, and if they have, remember I said nice things about you. The tone of mood were perfect throughout the entire film. It wasn't too sad or too emotional, and like you kind of still were kind of, where is this going? Um, you still had questions throughout the entire film until the end. The score was insanely perfect. Um, the attention to detail and design, how the animation switched from the flashback to the current situation the gentleman's in. It was a moving and breathtaking story. I cannot praise this film enough. In the future, I, I'm, I'm definitely just going to always have my iode on, on Claire Campbell. 100%. Great job. I was genuinely touched by this film. It is uh, powerful, uh, simple, and effective. Uh, the animation is great, and the choice to change the animation style when they decided to, I thought, was very clever, uh, very just brilliant on that part, uh, and both styles worked well. Um, and the story uh, is just... For a, again, for another story with no dialogue, it was just so powerful. Uh, it just speaks to the cycle of life and the sacrifices that nature makes for mankind. And I just thought it was really good and definitely worth watching. It's a beautiful story uh, from musical composition uh, to the animation, to the direction of the animation and the shots, uh, gorgeous. Very engaging, beautiful, uh, yeah, wonderfully done. This is fantastic work, and I hope to see more. It's awesome. It's a it's a great piece. It's an animation. It's an art piece, and the art direction was absolutely outstanding. It's like they built a mini world with real wood and grass and put a clay man in it. The, the sound of him shivering at night in bed, that was so authentic. As an actor, it made me want to take that and use it somewhere else later down the line. Great work. And this film seems like a, a conservation piece, a conservation awareness piece, more so on the lines of nature versus man. Great work, guys. I just really enjoyed Winter's Blight. I just thought it was an excellent piece. Um, really thought the character you could just feel him wilting away as each frame progressed. Uh, they did a great job on this. And it's, uh, yeah, memories do have that effect. Uh, good memories can often uh, inspire you um, and help you, you know, move forward from something that's uh, not working out like you thought it would. Just an excellent, excellent job. Really neat, really neatly done. Uh, really conveys the message well. Uh, to the viewer. Um, I loved it. Great film. I really like the style and the, the claymation and the story. Um, very well um, and done. The, but the I, characters in the world all felt really... I just like... It was very well done, uh, claymation. This one was uh, cool. It, it, it felt realistic as an animation. It seemed like realistic. The sound effects. I like the sound effects. Uh, they did a good job. Light was a lovely short. Um, I'm so intrigued. I wish I know we knew how they did it like was it all miniature house because it just looked so real that was brilliant and um, the story was um, moving and sad and um, heartwarming in a small way at the end and um, it was, was really cool to watch I wish I'd known how they did it it was, it was really interesting <laughs>